Hey guys, so this is part two of our big haul that we're doing this weekend. Um, this is the Forever 21 part because we bought the most from Forever, so we had to split it into two parts. So we did all the other stores that we went to in the previous video, so if you haven't watched that yet, the link will be down below if you want to see part one. But make sure you come back to this part to see this part because it's the most exciting, it's the biggest, most stuff that we bought, and it was really fun. Yes, very fun. I'd say it was really therapeutic, <laughs> I love it. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and start with jewelry. Firstly, oh, and also prices will be listed down below because I'm not going to just rattle them off right now and waste time um, since my camera's going to die and, you know, I'm just rambling right now. So, the first thing, I got a bunch of necklaces. I got this, you're not even going to be able to see it, but it's a little tiny um, heart locket with a floral design on it from there. And I got um, three different styles of this. So, this one's a little turquoise color one. I have the one I'm wearing right now, which is a black which is super cute, and the one that she's wearing, which is a blue, she borrowed it today, and they're all gold, um, she borrowed it today because it went with her outfit really nicely, and then I got two bracelets, they look like this, you can just take a look at them, I want to explain them, I got a set of bangles, just gold, because I have silver ones, and a bunch of rings, I got three rings, I got this one here, which looks like lava, it's super pretty with gold, and then I got this pink one, which is gold, which I think would look good with the cream tops that I have. And then the last ring I got was this one that she's also borrowing because it went with her outfit. It was just turquoise. So that's all the accessories I got. And then accessories that I got, I just got this one pair of earrings. I, again, my style's a little different than Sarah's, so the earrings I got actually are these. I really like them. And like I said before, I can wear these out a lot with a lot of uh, my different pieces that I have. So... The versatile, just like my pieces, I think. I also picked up a nail polish I forgot to mention. It's just like a forest green, which I think is really unique. Not a lot of people do forest green nails, so I thought I would try it. It's really cheap nail polish, too, so, you know. Now, I got so many basics, it's not even funny. So I'm literally just going to, like, just show you really quickly. Got a black tank top, two camis, one in, like, a green sage color and one in kind of a mauve purple color, almost gray toned. I got a long sleeve maroon top that was on sale for six bucks, so you know, why not? Just simple, flattering, got a basic white shirt, which is, has a really soft fabric because I'm looking one to be a little bit flowy, tucked into some skinny jeans or my new jeans that I got from American Eagle, which you can check out in the other haul. I got a basic black cardigan because I lost my Urban Outfitters one and I don't know where it went and I don't have a basic black one that has long sleeves and that's not cropped. So I needed one that was just a regular black cardigan. So Forever is really good for these kind of basics. Um, I got kind of a crop top that's kind of brown. You can see the bottom hem. It's a high-low hem and it's kind of like a taupe brown color actually. Oh, charcoal heather. It's not really charcoal though. It has a brown tinge to it. I got a really unique top that's also a crop top, but I think with that black tank with some skinny jeans or jean shorts in the summer, it'd be super cute. It has a really cool Aztec design on it. You want to start showing your stuff so we can sure. split it up because I still have a lot yeah. left. I'm going to start off with the shoes that I got at Forever 21. Um, like I said, I do go out a lot, so I wanted to get some things to kind of working with that going out night atmosphere type style that I have. So I first got these wedges. They are amazing. I love them to death. So um, good. I'm going to Kind of like them. a suede black here. And then it's strappy, open toe. The cool part is, is there's not any like buckles or anything. It's actually just a zipper on the back. Just zip. And yeah. So I, I love them to They're so death. high. They're like they seven inches high. They are absolutely comfortable They're though. so comfy. Oh, they are amazing. I cannot wait to wear them. Since we're the same size, I'm going to borrow them all the time. Uh, of course she is. Although I do borrow her back, so I guess it's a fair trade. Yeah, um, purse a lot. The other pair of shoes I got were these, um, like, neutral, soft brown, maybe you want to call it, I guess, mm -hmm. um, wedge. And um, kind of give off that cork look, but they're actually not cork. They don't feel cork. It's almost like a fake look. Yeah. Um, super comfortable. They do, however, buckle up the ankle. Again, open-toed. I really, really like these also. So we're good with summer dresses and stuff. Very much so. Then the piece that I bought today, because we did go two days in a row, <laughs> today's piece, I bought this um, this little dress here. It's kind of got this embroidery, white embroidery. It goes down the top of the sleeve like this. Um, it does tie at the waist. Little tie there as well. That's the tie. I don't know if you can see that, but there you go. And then the bottom also has this really cool detailing. I really like it. 
Um, I needed some dresses, so it kind of worked out for me. Um, another thing that I bought, um, I bought two of these, actually, were these maxi dresses. Just a basic spaghetti strap. This is the first one. It's purple. So it's very long. long. And then the other one I'm actually wearing now, but it's just a solid black one. Same spaghetti strap, detailing at the top. Um, and then I'll show this last piece, and then I'll let Sarah take back over. And this is a crop top. Um, it's so cute. It's like a knitted it's material. It's like my style, actually. <laughs> it is, but I'm actually, I bought it to go over things, specifically my maxi dresses. The black maxi dress. Maxi dress, to be specific. Mm -hmm. But um, I really like the way that it feels. It's very light. I'm not a big fan of the thick knits. Um, so I like not that like this me. is very, like, breezy and open, and I won't get all, like, hot and sweaty, so... Next, I'm going to talk about the shirt I'm wearing. I got this crop top. It's, um, I'll show you, it's kind of boxy. Um, it's like open sleeves almost. It has a leopard um, Union Jack flag on it. So I thought it was really cool. And I actually don't go for leopard. I'm not a big fan at all of animal know. print. She loves animal print, but she I wear it. Room. <laughs> Her whole room's animal yes, print. But um, I wear it a little bit different. It's a little bit more edgy. She's a little bit more feminine with it. But yeah. I also got, what is this? I don't even know. A charcoal top, like a basic, another basic. All these are basics, just so I can know. A long sleeve black shirt, pretty basic. I got a gray v-neck, simple. They're probably my favorite thing that I got out of the whole thing, because I've been looking for a taupe sweater for the longest effing time, I, can, I can't even tell you. And Urban had the best one, but it was like $80, and I can't really spend $80 on a cardigan, I just feel weird doing that. <laughs> So it's this cream colored cardigan. It's really chunky knit, but it's like, it's really different kind of fabric, almost like a towel. I can't explain it. And then it has three brown buttons down the front, which look really cute. It can be buttoned or not, but I think it's just a good throw over. It can be cuffed or rolled up, and I just think it's really comfy and unique. And then the other two pieces... Oh, don't forget your cardigan. Oh, I can't forget that too. <laughs> yes, I got another basic black cardigan. It just uh, buttons up here. As you guys can see, kind of got that going on there. Um, exactly the same one as Sarah got, obviously, but in a bigger size. So, no, it's not. Yes, it is. It's one size bigger. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, and then the other thing that I got actually was this really, really nice. I almost want to say cashmere, but it's not. Um, it's oversized nice pink sweater. Um, it's it's V-neck. Um, I probably will wear something like light underneath it. Probably a cami. Might wear. Um, I can wear it over a maxi, obviously. Um, can belt it. I'm not really sure what I'll do yet. I really, leggings, I mean, yeah, leggings. It's possibilities are tops. endless. So skinny I well, really like it. Jeans, not skinny, <laughs> no. Um, and the other thing I got, again, getting back to that nightclub atmosphere that I like to do and like to go out and have fun. Um, I got this um, dress here. It's got this like chain detailing on it. If you guys can see that, but um, it's purple. The top part is sheer. The bottom half it comes up almost like a pencil skirt. It's just basic black. As for the back, the detailing is this really cool zipper, which I think is awesome, and it zips all the way down. So almost all the way down. Fits really well. I love it. Um, it's her body shape really nice. Yes, it's definitely complimenting. Um, I usually mm -hmm. don't go for the attached like pieces top and like the skirt. this, but it, really it good looks on. really good on. So yeah, that's what I got. Is that so, all? That is all that's for all. me. So that's all we got this weekend. That's the second part of a haul. Make sure you check out the first part because that's some fun stuff in there too. A lot of beauty products. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed our Forever 21 yes. haul. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.